Sat Nam and Namaste. This is Hari Bhajan and we're on day 15 of Thanks to Me from A to Z. That brings us to the letter O and the word I've chosen for O is own, to possess. You did it. Everything. Everything in your life you did. Um, you own it. You smacked that little kid on the playground It's in grammar school. Um, you took your sister's diary and hid it under the bed. You cheated on that math test. You uh, lied on an employment application. You lied to your spouse. You lied to yourself. And on and on and on. You did all of those things. You know, you may say, so what? You know, that was long ago. I didn't really mean to. It wasn't done in, to harm anyone. Um, but the idea is to, to review, to own what you did, um, to review it, to see if there is anything in your life that um, is still kind of in there. It's annoying you. It's bothering you. Maybe you need to make some reparations. Um, or maybe you just need to be to, to let it go or to serve in another way that will balance it out. Um, this way, you release your karma. Um, if you are still, if you still don't, you know, recognize that, you know, or you blame someone else uh, about the circumstances, then that's really not owning your life. Now, the other side is the good news is that you also get to own. Um, the time that you stood up to the bullies and protected that scrawny little kid uh, or you stood in for someone at work when you gave up a weekend and stayed, stood in for someone who was sick at work or you threw that wonderful, incredible surprise party for your child or your, your, um, your loved one. Those things often are harder. I know they are for me really to recognize the positive or the righteous things I've done in life. Um, you know, we don't want to be in our ego like, you know, putting it on the front page of the paper or shouting it to the world, but, you know, it doesn't hurt to say, you know, give ourselves a little pat on the back and say, good job, that was something that was, that was meaningful to someone else and boy, did it make me feel good inside as well. Um, you can acknowledge where you've succeeded and be proud of yourself. Um, you aren't just your mistakes. That's the that's the beauty. You know, we are our mistakes, our learnings, our lessons, and so are our victories. They bring us uh, that balance, that understanding that we are both yin and yang. We are both uh, right and wrong, but in the end, we are one being, and you are one being, and. Um, if you own your life, if you own what you do, then, then that's, you know, that will make you really uphold and trust and love other people to a greater degree because you will understand um, the breadth and challenges that life brings. So I ask you to own your full life with love and compassion and understand that it's your life, it belongs to you. Satnam and Namaste.